course, as families are continuing to try to regroup after fires hit the Panhandle, our very own Alyssa Riggs is sharing the story of one woman who lost almost everything. When the wildfire got close to Canadian, Sky Wilson packed an overnight bag, her four boys, and her horses, and hit the road. Wilson left behind her home, her leather workshop, and horse stalls, with one pony, Chorizo, who wouldn't load. I don't know if she was scared or what, she wouldn't load. Say a prayer, put her in there, and you gotta go. When residents were allowed back in town, Wilson's husband checked on Chorizo. He immediately went and checked on her. And he said, she's alive. She doesn't even have a scratch. For her to be alive is a miracle. A firefighter friend shared after, when they saw Chorizo, they sprayed water around her to keep her safe. Although Chorizo is okay, Wilson and her family lost their home, horse stalls, and shop, with sewing machines, tools, and a huge inventory of leather. Everything to have a business. I've been doing this for going on six years, and so I had built up a lot of things. All of it was just within an hour of leaving town was gone. Wilson says when she got back to the remains of her house, she was only able to save two buckets worth of belongings. There are things that can be replaced, but everything that you wish you would have grabbed or anything like you, your head just kind of starts Oh, I should have gotten that, or I should have done that. She says growing up in the Texas Panhandle, wildfires are something you deal with. In the past, their family has experienced cattle and land burned, but never a lost home. In Canadian, Alyssa Riggs, News Channel 10.